how it was in terms of what you expected? Um, I don't know. I, really, I haven't sunk in yet, to be honest. I'm not so, I'm still processing it right now. Uh, I mean, I was fifth, so I guess I should be happy, but I thought I was close. I, I don't know. Now I see how close I was, and like, if I just maybe cover the move for another 300 meters and stuck in it, um, who knows, maybe they would have been within striking range. Um, I just thought, you know, I'm, I'm happy. I don't know. I like... I can't be disappointed with the season. I wanted to play. That was a huge goal. And uh, to come out here and still run pretty well, um, I mean, that's just still all I can ask for, really. I, mean, I wasn't expecting to make the team. I was just going to put myself in the best position possible. And I uh, came a little short, but it's a hell of a learning experience. And uh, I think I'm only going to get better. Uh, how, how, how good did you feel you know, being in that position to be able to take it out like that? Well, I kind of didn't want to lead, but... Um, I don't know, like why not? Like, I didn't push the pace though. Like, I just kind of went to the front, just so I could kind of dictate my race. Um, that was something I didn't want to get overwhelmed coming in here and start running someone else's race and like forget the focus. And so, by going to the front, it kind of put me in control and I was able to just like settle into the, the atmosphere and everything. And uh, I don't regret taking the lead. Like, I don't think it really really changed the outcome that much. But um, yeah, I, I like being aggressive. I think. I wanted to put on a show. I just wanted to be bold and do something crazy. Absolutely. I mean, 1,200, 800 left. I mean, uh, uh, it was was the body feeling like uh, like uh, like we, like we can tackle this and we can make something something special happen? Yeah, I mean, I thought, honestly, I thought, like, I knew three to go. I went to the front, or maybe it was four to go. And I was like, all right. So I stuck with him, kind of followed him. Uh, Stanley kind of, like, cut me off on the rail. So I ended up getting shuffled back to, like, third. And then the two to go, Cabral kind of went around. I was still like, okay, just hang on, just, like, Stare at the back of these guys, settle into the rhythm, and uh, I just, I just slowly kind of bled off. It just, I wouldn't say I felt bad. I was just, maybe that was kind of the end of the fuse after it's a play. It's just, I couldn't give that extra one percent that I needed to just focus on and just attack into the last lap. And uh, so I do regret that. You said you bled off. Your yeah, I just yeah. kind of, you know, just, uh, yeah, we'll see. Uh, it was a slow, was just like, just a little bit out of my comfort zone. I was just trying to like. Hoping so, I can maintain yeah, contact. You're, you're 19, right? 22. 20, 22. Okay, so yeah. how do you feel you about being here at the Olympic no trials? I mean, yeah. you didn't make the team, but you, you know, had a gallant effort. I would, you would probably feel right. Yeah, I mean, I think yeah. my best years are ahead of me. Like, I feel like I'm young. I feel like I'm undeveloped. Like, I personally and my coach think we have a huge way to go. We can make huge jumps, which is the exciting part. So that's why I'm not, like, bummed. I know my turn will come, I guess, if I just keep on focusing and doing what I've been doing. Speaking of the future, what are you going to be doing next year? Are you going to stay in Ann Arbor and train? Uh, that's up for debate right now. I mean, hopefully I'm not wearing a Block M in the next couple of weeks. But, um, I mean, it's treated me well. But I think, uh, you know, trying to get something else going. Yeah. Have you talked to anybody? Or I have had talks, yeah. I do have an agent, Dan Lila. And, uh, so, we've, you know, it's been kind of a, a whirlwind after NCAAs. Maybe things didn't move as quickly as we expected to. But my main goal is just to be patient and focus on the racing at hand. You know, not get overwhelmed with you know trying to find a sponsor right away it was just race first prepare for the race everything will you know work its way out does that make it more pressure field like i don't have a contract i gotta run better no nah, i don't think so like i've shown what i can do i think yeah i might not have made the team right now but i was fifth and like i'm biting right at the heels of the guys that i want to beat so i think there's you know i still have the upside we were, we were talking to court